Hey everyone, I just want to go over some uh, updated, um, new, easier instructions for installing the um, LBF mod. Um, and then after I do that, I'm going to go over a couple things to keep in mind, um, really about backing up your data. Um, so the first thing is, in order to um, uh, install this, all you have to do is extract the zip file into this into this area, which is basically you look for your user username at your app data folder. App data folder might be hidden, so you need to make sure you have to have hidden items clicked. Um, then go to local legend bold data custom rosters and basically extract the file into here. So you'll create this folder. You may or may not have these inbox and outbox files here. Um, they get created um, during playing the game, so depending on what you've done, you may not see these here. Um, but all you need to do is double click on the LBF folder and then click on the program and it'll open it up and it's ready to go. You hit draft, it should have all the default stuff in here um, ready for you to use. Um, I do want to mention a few things though, um, so that way you can be ready in case you want to customize this or make sure if you're using this, you're backing your stuff up. So the first thing to note is that here, if you want to import custom rosters, uh, there's a folder that the, the mod is going to use. And so this folder has your the sort of default coaches, players, and teams files in it. And whatever file, if you want to change the players that are used, like you want to use your own custom players to, to begin the software, then you can do that. Own custom teams, own custom coaches. Just copy and paste them into here. Um, so for some of you, I might be using an NFL mod or whatever. You can come and paste those NFL players in here and use this mod with those NFL players. Um, the other thing is I have a backup folder here um, which contains the default backup files and that's in case you you mess with this um, and then you decide later you want to go back to default. Um, the When this program runs it's going to run through the um, uh, you know run through the draft or free agency whatever you do and it's going to um, basically copy over the files that are in here um, and replace them. Um, the other thing it's going to do is it's going to go here into this inbox and it's going to create the same three files in this inbox. What happens when you run the game is the game takes the files in the inbox and puts them in the outbox. And it will use the files in the outbox if there's nothing in the inbox. So this is basically how the game decides what sort of files to use. So be sure that um, you, if you, you know, have any um, your own files that you're using, make sure that you back them up before running the software um, because it'll overwrite them if they're in these folders. Um, and so if also if you've been running several seasons using this um, franchise mod, you may want to ever after each season or so back up this folder somewhere else. That way um, if something messes up or you do something you don't didn't want to do, then you can always come back and, and go back a season or so. Um, and that's basically about it. I just want to make sure you kept that in mind um, when, when running this software to just make sure you back your stuff up. Uh, if you have any questions, um, make sure you see the Discord that's in the link. Uh, we have a, a little forum within that um, Discord channel uh, that is just for this mod. So feel free to ask any questions on that forum and I'd be happy to try to answer them for you. Also, let me know if you have any bugs. Um, I'd be glad to take a look at that um, as well. Uh, so um, good luck and have fun uh, playing Legend Bowl.